Come on in. It's raining. <laughs> oh, this is the the romantic side of adventure that isn't often represented. You know, when the skies open and the thunder begins to crack and you have to pull off the cycle path alongside the main road to seek shelter beneath an overhang of a budget supermarket. And it's so wet that you can tell that it's wet because people are just hanging out inside the foyer of Penny. That's not something that they advertise often either. Ah, oh, day 13 of Journey 13. I don't know if this is part of it actually. Hopefully it will brighten up a little bit later. And we're in Hungary. We crossed over from Slovakia and Bratislava yesterday. So I am in Slovakia. And I am in Hungary. You're a We made camp deep in a field after a little bit of a wild camp hunting mission last night, which was only moderately successful. Then, yeah, we went along a flood dike and found just this lovely, lovely little meadow. Em's had a little uh, episode. I'm not fully, fully. <laughs> With long grass and M gets hay fever so she was sneezing and fluttering a little bit but we got inside and flattened everything down and you know what it's like when you're camping in long grass everything feels just like a lovely spongy mattress underneath it was gorgeous first day in hungary was really hot yesterday it's only the third t-shirt day that we've had on this trip so it hasn't all been plain sailing weather-wise what have we seen <laughs> Just got <laughs> nailed by a fly. <laughs> nice to see some horses, baby. Yeah. <laughs> I thought one flew in your eye then. How you doing, baby? Good, I've got one in my mouth, so. I want one. Quick, before the old man. <laughs> <laughs> he heard it, didn't he? Yeah, he, need ju he jumped out of his skin. <laughs> you don't need a bell. <laughs> Now where are we going? We've got maybe 250 miles or so to go. We'll probably pass Budapest, edge around it, and then head down the Danube and return via some lakes and national parks before culminating in Hungary's capital. But despite this weather, spirits are high and very glad for this helium jacket from Outdoor Research, brand pimp. It weighs 200 grams. I'm so impressed with it. I've had loads of lightweight cycling jackets before and they all just permeate water. It's just kept us perfect. It's been raining a hell of a lot this trip and we haven't got wet yet, so... Thank you, Outdoor Research. Excellent work. Right, Em's gone in to buy some... what I hope is sugary pan au chocolat or donuts for breakfast. She'll probably come out with some cabbage or something. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> ciao, ciao. Bye. Meaty paste. Oh, <laughs> You know what I love about you, baby? What? Is that you go shopping with your bicycle helmet on? Yeah. Well, otherwise you just gotta carry it. 